What is going on, my YouTube friends? So the other day I made a video on the Stifler's uh, cross member for the transmission to show you what I was going to do and what I needed to do to get done to make this fit. But things have changed. So I called Stifler's just to call him. You know, uh, No Fox Given was telling me that he always calls them and stuff and they're good people. So I figured I'm going to try them out. So it's what I did. I called him up, <clears throat> told him what I had to do to make it fit. And he, got, he goes, it'll work. He goes, just make sure you get your cuts right and this and that. You know, because I explained to him, I work in a machine shop. I can, I can get these done. I can cut them down. It's not a problem. I says, but if you have the parts and I can just get them from you, I'll pay you for them and send me the right parts. And that way I know it's right when I get them. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got to do it cut twice, cut three times, measure twice, cut once. I ain't got to do none of that. So he goes, you know what? I'm going to do you. I'm going to do you this for you. I'm going to send you the parts. And I just want you to pay shipping. So I gave him 10 bucks for shipping, man. You can't beat, you can't beat a company like that that's willing to help his customers out. So that's great customer service. So if you need anything, man, call Stifflers, man. I'm telling you right now, dude. I just think that's awesome that they gave me the parts I needed to do the fix that I need. But let's turn this around and see what we got going on, baby. Mm-hmm. So here's the cross members and here's the shims that come with the cross members and stuff like that. Like I said, I was going to have to cut these ends down because they're too long. And it's gonna, there's another shim right there. So I called Stifflers up and I told him what I was going to do and what I would have to do to make it fit. And uh, the guy was really, really cool. You know what I'm saying? So uh, we got to talking for a few moments and this and that. And I explained to him. And he goes, yeah, if you can cut them down. He goes, if you got a lathe or whatever. He says, you know, go ahead and try it. And I'm like... Why, well, you know, I'm a machinist, so I can do it. That's not a problem. I says, but the thing about it is, if you have the parts, that way I know they're right, and I won't have to make them work. <laughs> and he's like, okay. And he goes, well, I'll tell you what. He goes, I'm going to give you the parts. He goes, well, all I'm asking is to pay shipping. I says, sure, I'll pay shipping. Not a problem, man. I really appreciate it, you know, because I like when people do good things for people. So he sent me the parts. I know I've already taken them out of the box, but I haven't taken them out of this yet. And uh, I always save this stuff in case you need packing material, right? See what we got going on here. Now, that's what I'm talking about right there. This is customer service. This is definitely customer service. We all like a good customer service. So let me set that there. I call this my Good Billy Boxing Glove. And no. What's a hillbilly without a boxing glove, right? So let's pull that out. He gave me all the nuts and bolts, the proper size. Right here was the size that came with the cross member. So yeah, that's a bit different, wouldn't you say? Mm-hmm. Sit there, right there. Let's keep these together. You never know, I might need those, use those again. And then that's the sleeve for the bolts to go through and go in. So let's get this. Let me see if I can pull a sleeve out of here right quick. So we got it out. Let's sit that right there. And that's the difference. Big difference, wouldn't you say? So we can just slide this back into there. See how easy it slides in there. Perfect. And then we have these shims. Goes right on there. So that should fit right in there perfectly. So I kind of wonder if these shims are wider than these ones, if I would really had to cut them down. Oh, yeah. Yeah. So right there. So they're a little wider. And they're that. Perfect. Perfect. And that's the other shims that they had. So 
Stiflers, if you're watching this, man, I appreciate you. I really do. Thank you. You did save me some time. Yes, you did. So let me turn this back around. It's always good to know that you got a place that you can do what that's going to take care of the customers. He didn't have to do that. I'd have bought the parts. But he decided to give them to me, which makes it that much better. You know what I'm saying? So it saves me a few dollars to put into the Fairmont, right? Maybe I should give it to the wife for helping me. No, no, we're going to spend it on the Fairmont. She gets what she wants anyhow because she's a little spoiled. Don't tell her I said that, but I'm sure she'll watch this and she'll say, and yell at me. So anyhow, guys, I appreciate you guys. You guys are awesome. And if anybody tells you any different, you tell them come see me and I'll tell them you're awesome. You have a great rest of your day, night, or whatever time it is you watch this. And Stifflers, thank you. Thank you so much. And I hope I'm saying your name right.